Vamos prosseguindo com a série de Mass Effect 1, edição legendária, e vamos a mais uma parte aqui da série. Bom, vamos ver o que eu tenho que fazer agora aqui. Ocupe-se dos laboratórios de segurança. Escolhi deixar essa espécie viva, né? Eu poderia ter acabado com ela. Mas como eles foram forçados, né? Foram capturados. Eles não têm culpa do que, que aconteceu aqui. Deixa eu ver se dá pra mim. É, aqui eu não tenho mais opção de nada. Bom, aqui não tá abrindo mais. aqui aqui onde é que eu tava onde é que eu tinha entrado ver se é por aqui opa onde é que eu fui are you here to secure the situation how are you holding up you, you must listen to me If we do not contain our mistake, they will drop bombs from the battle stations. You understand? I don't understand anything yet. What were you doing here? Binary Helix found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachni's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. A thousand-year-old egg hatched? Yes. Very tough to be so long frozen. That it survived the centuries. This is miraculous. Binary Helix plan to clone Rachni. Mass produce them, create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Rachni. It is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rift Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Hold on. Don't you need a male to get eggs? Queens are born carrying the genetic code of their fathers. The eggs are carried away from the colony to hatch alone. Queens can lay eggs in hours and have a colony in days. This is how they spread so quickly. Separating them from their mother didn't work. Uh, this was exactly the wrong thing to do. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Rachni are uncontrollable. Then all we need to do is bring her here. No, I am sorry, but this will not work. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. I am thinking that the neutron purge must be set off. I'm not familiar with the purge system. It creates bursts of neutron radiation, kills everything within the station. Things beyond get genetic damage of varying degree. Once the purge is armed, we'll have to fight our way out. Give us a minute to patch up and rearm. Sure, sure. I wait here. I am not so much good for searching now, yes? <laughs> Mother always say I would meet a bad end.
Vamos ver agora. Connecting. I have full access to the facility and am at your disposal. Cara, não sei, velho. I need information on the neutron purge. The neutron purge is a fail-safe system installed within the isolation tube area. In the event of irretrievable containment loss, it is used to resolve the situation. What exactly does this thing do? The purge is a neutron burst weapon. Two volumes of fissionable materials are brought together to form a critical mass. Most of the energy is released in the form of high-speed neutrons. This radiation is instantly lethal to any known form of life within 500 meters. Nah, just a pleasant afternoon in the sun for a Krogan. The purge is lethal to all known forms of... Shut up. Last thing I need is some virtual wench questioning my fitness. Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Who would have the code? Director of Operations, Yaroslav Tartakovsky, or any executive officer of Binary Helix. We're moving on. Logging you out, Commander. Cara, vou ter que conseguir esses códigos agora. Ué? I am feeling not so well. How do we set off the purge? Arming controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then uh, I will give Mira a restart. Mais dessa agora. Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code on Code input 875-020-079. Code Omega. Local execution. Verify. Code Omega execution in 120 seconds. Corre, 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 que deu ruim. Ah, nossa. 
Nossa, mano. Acho que deu certo. O que, que eu tenho que fazer agora? Missão completada. Você derrotou a matriarca e eliminou os Hash. Hackney nos laboratórios de segurança. Saia da estação Rift pelo transporte de passageiros que você chegou. Nossa, aqui eu nem... Eu nem consegui entrar nesse lugar aqui. Quero ver só se eu não... Ah não, não tem mais opção ali. Deixa eu ver uma coisa aqui antes. Eu quero ver se eu não tenho nenhum diálogo com, diálogo com as... Com as pessoas aqui. Aqui onde é que eu tava Será que abre a porta lá na frente? Não abre Então não adianta, tem que sair daqui lento isso aqui, hein? What's our next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The commander's right. We can't rush off blind. We need more to go on. What about Liara Tassoni? The, the matriarch's daughter. Isn't she some kind of expert on the Protheans? Yeah, right. Her mother was working for Saren. I bet she is too. But Nezia helped us in the end. Maybe Liara will too. At the very least, we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster to find her. Who put you in charge? Did the commander resign when I wasn't looking? We're all on the same team here, Williams. She's just trying to help. Sorry, Commander. This is a tough mission. We're all on edge. Everyone go get some rest. Crew, dismissed. Ovaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch it through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? You found Rachni on Novaria? And then release the Queen. Do you have any idea what you've done? How many generations until they overrun the galaxy? This queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. My children's children will pay the price if you're not. We'll be waiting for your next report, Commander. Okay. Yes, Commander. Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. Não tem um diálogo novo. Vamos ver se tem para cá. Opa, aqui tinha um códex agora. Ó. Why am I glad to be off of Novaria? I don't know which was worse, the cold or the corporations. One will freeze your balls off, the other will sell them out from under you. With all due respect, Commander. How'd you end up joining the Alliance? Look, if you're looking for an inspirational tale of it, my mother was a civilian. Spend all that time. I have to go. All right, see you. Não tenho nada aqui de interessante.
Vamos ver se tem mais algum diálogo aqui. Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Is this an official evaluation, Commander? Or off the record? Elenko, when it's just you and me, you can consider it off the record. That's a generous attitude. Okay. I think there's something wrong with all this. This Saren is looking for a lost mass relay, but who knows where? But we can't get backup from the council? Sorry, Commander. There's writing on the wall here, but someone isn't reading it. The council doesn't want to believe anything's wrong. I'd call it human nature, but... I hear you. It, it just seems like a group that's been around as long as the council should see this coming. Sorry if I got too informal. Protocol wasn't a big focus back in Bot. Tell me about it. Biotic acclimation and temperance didn't last past the airlock. To the kids they hauled in, it was brain camp. Sorry, all in is unkind. We were encouraged to commit to an evaluation of our abilities so an understanding of biotics could be compiled. There are worse results of accidental exposure to element zero in the womb. Beats the brain tumors some kids grew up with. Is there some question about how you were exposed? My mother was downwind of a transport crash. It was before there were human biotics, a little after the discovery of the Martian ruins. It only gets iffy around 63 when Kinetics was running out of first-gen subjects. Until then, they'd relied on accidentals. Bunch of guys in suits show up at your door after school, and next thing you know, you're out on Jump Zero. Jump Zero is a long way from home. What was it like? The grand gateway to humanity looks a lot better in the vids. But that's my own baggage, Commander. No bearing on this. Alenko, there's no regulation that says you can't be friends with your commander. I appreciate that, Commander. I just don't want you to think that I'm a, a whiner. Besides, I've got my past squared away. Aqui não tem nada. Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? I should Goodbye, go. Commander. Aqui não tem nada de novo. Bom, lembra que eu comprei uns negócios pro aqui pro vendedor da Normandie. Vamos ver se vai aparecer coisa nova aqui, né? Looking for supplies? Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. Quero só ver que pistola que eu tenho. Eu tô usando uma Kess Kessler 5. Não. Uma Stinger 2 eu tô usando. Looking for supplies? Let's see what you've you bet, Commander. Vamos ver aqui. Oh, olha o preço disso. É, não tem nada. Não vou gastar nada aqui. Por agora. Commander, good to see you. You've been with CSEC a while? Well, not as much as you, but... Yeah, I've seen some interesting things. I'll bet you have. I Anything? remember this Solarian geneticist I was sent to investigate. That case was a bit... disturbing. What happened? Why were you investigating them? I was tasked with tracking black market trade on the... Sei que hoje ele já... So what was... So how did you fix... Eu já so falei com ele isso aqui. What did you do? Vamos ver aqui oh, se tem diálogo novo. Go? Aqui you parece que tem, ó. Commander Shepard now? We saw him on the news here. He's ah. cute. Later, sis. Tell me you didn't hear that. Your sister, I assume? Until I get home and kill her. That's Sarah, the youngest. What's up? You didn't come by to eavesdrop on family mail. Your family seems to be important to you. 
Yeah, we've always been close. Me and my sisters, especially. Com essa Ashley que tem interações românticas, eu acho. Next, you'll tell me you all ran across green fields singing show tunes. Don't knock show tunes. I might have to take exception. Things were tense between Sarah and me for a while. Then we bonded. Sounds like your father wasn't around much. Wasn't your family stationed near him? Dad always wanted to serve in space, but he wanted us to have real ground under our feet. He'd say space is beautiful, but you can't raise a family there. I cannot rest from travel. I will drink life to the lees. All times I've enjoyed greatly have suffered greatly, both with those that loved me and alone. For always roaming with a hungry heart, much have I seen and known. Cities of men and manners, climates, councils, governments. Que tédio. I didn't know you liked classical literature. Ulysses was my dad's favorite poem. Every time he shipped out, he recorded me reading it. He had a dozen versions when he retired. Does he still like it? I sure hope so. I read it to his grave every time I go home. Dad passed on a few years back. He's probably still watching though. So behave. You mean from wherever we go after death? Dead on Skipper. He's with God now. That's not a problem with you, is it? That I believe in God? You know that old saw, there's never an atheist in a foxhole? I've been in a lot of foxholes. Yeah, I guess you have. I've met a few people who were really weirded out by my faith. Because I work in space, I can't believe in a higher power. Jeez. Hello, have you people looked out the window? How can you look at this galaxy and not believe in something? I should get back to my duties. Didn't mean to take up so much of your time. What's your opinion on the last mission? You mean the Rachni, right? They were dangerous, Skipper. They proved that 2,000 years ago. I think it was a mistake to let them go. But that wasn't my call to make. It was yours. You know, when we pick up that Asari scientist, we'll have to tell her we killed her mom. Just saying, Skipper. We'll talk later, Williams. Looking forward to it, Skipper. What do you want, Shepard? Why did you become a mercenary? Lots of reasons. Such as? Such as? I needed to get out of our system. I needed to eat. I needed to survive. Why not stay and help your people? I tried to help. That's why I had to leave. What happened? I was betrayed. I was head of a small tribe. We were trying to restore order after the war. But the other tribes Traído were against us. Tribo. They followed Jared. One of the few warlords who survived the war with the Turian. Essa raça do Rex aí é uma raça meio rebelde. Uma raça que não tem muita paciência. Muita paciência, né, no caso. Each other. It didn't matter who, as long as we were fighting. What did you want? I just wanted Jared to shut up, to stop his ranting. I wanted him to stop leading the tribes astray. But he couldn't understand how much things had changed. We didn't have the numbers to go to war. Even if we did, the genophage made sure we couldn't replenish our numbers fast enough. And for a while, we were getting through. Some of the tribes started coming around. I take it the warlord didn't appreciate that. No, he didn't. He arranged a crush with the tribes, a meeting on neutral ground. He wanted women at the hollows, near the graves of our ancestors. The skulls of our dead laid bare to remind us where we come from. It's as sacred as any Krogan place can be. Violence is forbidden. It sounds like a trap to me. You must have suspected as much. I did. But when your father invites you to a crush, well... There are some laws that even we hold sacred. Jared was your father? He was. Until that day. We talked. But we didn't get anywhere. When it was clear that I wouldn't join him, he gave the signal. His men leapt from the graves of our ancestors like Krogan undead. The few that were loyal to me died quickly. I escaped with my life. 
but not before I sank my dagger deep into my father's chest. Where could That is why I left. And that's why I'll never go back. So long, Rex. Shepard. História pesada, hein? Something I can do for you, Commander. Carry on. Aye, aye, Commander. Shepard, I'm glad you're here. Good to see you smiling again. So to speak. I'm sleeping much better now. I guess I'm getting used to how quiet your ship is. I still think a lot about my pilgrimage, though. I know Steren's our top priority, but with all the worlds we go to, I was hoping to find something to bring back to the flotilla. We've still got a long way to go. You'll find something to take back. Yes, but it cannot just be some derelict ship my people can use for salvage. It has to be more than that. There's a lot expected of me. What's so special about you? It's my father. He's the senior member of the Admiralty Board. He's one of only five people who can overrule the decisions of the Conclave for the good of the migrant fleet. My father is responsible for the lives of 17 million people. Our entire race is in his hands, and I'm his only child. So are you some kind of heir to the Quarian throne or something? No, it doesn't work that way. My father's position isn't hereditary. I'll probably never serve on the Admiralty Board myself. Officially, I'm just the same as any other citizen. But it doesn't work that way in practice. People have always treated me differently because of who my father is. It must be tough on you. My people place a high value on family and ancestry. There's an unspoken expectation that I'll live up to my father's example. Everyone's waiting for me to do something great on my pilgrimage. Something that will forever change our lives for... If I don't, it's like I failed. And that reflects badly on both me and my father. The work you're doing here is more important than anything any Quarian has ever done before. Yes, I know. But you have to understand Quarian culture. We're a very insular society. The events beyond the flotilla don't much matter to the average citizen. Our greatest dream is that one day, we'll return to our homeworld and drive out the Geth. But even if we stop Saren, that's not going to happen. There's still millions of Geth behind the Veil. Until they're gone, our exile will continue. What would you need to bring back to make everyone happy? Something that would help us better understand the Geth. They've changed significantly since the exile. They've continued to evolve. We've done our best to study them, but it's not easy. They're very reclusive. Until recently, they never went beyond the borders of the Vale. And all the Geth we run into now are under Saren's control. We'd need to find Geth operating on their own independently but i don't want this to get in the way of our mission shepherd first we stop Saren, then i'll worry about what was your father life. like it wasn't easy growing up as the daughter of one of the admiralty even before he joined the board he was a prominent figure he had to set an example and he expected the same of his daughter porque na nave mano tem bastante diálogo sempre quando sempre que o cara vai numa missão e volta é bom falar com todo mundo né que o cara destrava as missões adicionais e descobre mais sobre a tripulação né bom que vai ganhando XP né por isso where was your mother in all this mother was around but she always seemed to kind of blend into the background Almost like she was overshadowed by my father. She passed on about five years ago. Some airborne virus that swept through the fleet. Happens sometimes when the filters start to break down. I think my father took it pretty hard. After she was gone, he became even more focused on his work. I think that was his way of dealing with the grief. Sounds like a tough upbringing. You don't resent your father at all? Like I said, it wasn't easy. My father's not the kind of person you bond with. And he wasn't around all that much. Too busy. People counted on him, and he took his duties seriously. Even when he was around, he always seemed a bit distant. Like his mind was always somewhere else. Come to think of it, I can't ever remember seeing him smile. Not once. It's like he was always weighed down by all that responsibility. I mean, I know he cares about me, but he never really showed it. 
not in the usual way. I guess the best thing I can say about my father is that I respect him. I want to talk about something. Else. Like what? I should go. See you later. 140 de experiência. Só yes, uma coisa aqui. Speak freely, Presley. I want to know if you have a problem with non-humans. I trust you, Commander. If you think they belong here, they had the numbers. Eu já falei com ele. I got my officer. Yes, sir. É, isso aqui é a mesma coisa que eu falei com ele antes. Então não teve nada novo. Eu quero ver aqui com o Joker. Eu, eu me lembro que eu ganhei uma experiência aqui com ele. Something you need? Why does everyone call you Joker? It's a lot shorter than saying Alliance. Look, I didn't pay. I have to go. All right, see you. I think I just told him. So it was just the luck that he had again. So I don't have anything else. Well, let's see what's next, guys. I want to see what's next. O planeta que eu tava, ó, galera. Ele é menos um grau Celsius. Superfície. É de boa. É aqui que eu tenho que ir, ó. Century. Bora cair fora desse planeta. Coming in, Commander. Big surprise. The Alliance needs you again. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett with Alliance Command. We've got a mission for you. An Alliance officer named Major Kyle has set up a small compound in the Hulking Hedda cluster. He's attracted a number of followers, mostly biotics. He's become an outspoken critic of the Alliance, and we believe he's mentally unstable. This could be trouble, Shepard. I'll look into it. Three days ago, we sent two Alliance representatives to meet with him at his compound. They've disappeared. We believe Kyle and his followers killed them. That compound is a cult, Shepard. They call him Father Kyle now. He set himself up as a kind of religious leader. You said his followers were biotics? Yes. Major Kyle never showed any biotic tendencies himself, though. I think he's just latched onto a group he identifies with. Many biotics feel marginalized or ostracized by society. Kyle probably sees them as victims who need his protection, and they see him as someone who will fight for them. Unfortunately, he's convinced them that the Alliance is somehow responsible for all their problems. We can't let him go on like this. What were those Alliance representatives going to talk to Major Kyle about? They wanted to bring him back to an Alliance facility for treatment. Major Kyle served us faithfully for many years. We weren't going to abandon him. Given his state of mind, however, he probably saw them as a threat. We're almost certain he had his followers kill them. What else can you tell me about Major Kyle? He used to be a model soldier, but something happened to him at Torfin. Too many Alliance soldiers died under his command. Couldn't cope with the guilt. His psych evaluations showed he couldn't handle the stress of command anymore. He was given an honorable discharge in early retirement. We'd hoped he would get better in time, but we underestimated how far gone he was. Now it looks like it's too late. I might be able to end this without violence. You serve with him. He might listen to you. But he's already killed two Alliance representatives. 
I trust you to use your judgment. Hack it out. Okay, man. Planeta aqui não. Atmosfera de dióxido de carbono e xenônio. Exploração de metal leve. Ó. Aqui, mano. Press Hop é a lua de Clendagon. Menos 73 graus, graus Celsius. Vamos descer ali. Ok galera, vamos explorar esse lugar. Olha lá o planeta, ó. Show de bola. Tem alguma coisa pra cá. Parando, não posso atacar. Não é credo, mano. Alguma coisa pra cá, hein?
Uh, que altura, toma. Nossa, que estrago. Não tem nada. Vamos ver se a gente acha mais coisas pra cá. Aqui, ó. Você completou a prospecção de um grande depósito de urânio, ó. 6 mil, hein? Caramba, é só buraco, meu, nesse lugar. E aqui não tem nada. Só até o fim aqui pra ver se eu acho alguma coisa. Pra cá, ó. E não tem nada. Vamos reto aqui, ó. Ver o que, que a gente acha. Mais um ali, ó. Mais material aqui na frente. Ouro, hein? Porra! O 
Grande depósito de ouro. Só ver o que, que tem aqui. This is a private sanctuary. Outsiders are not welcome here. I need to talk to the man in charge. It's important. Father Kyle wants nothing more to do with the Alliance. I want this to end peacefully. If he doesn't see me, people could get hurt. We won't let you take Father Kyle away. He protects us. We need him. The Alliance wants someone to pay for those murders. Let me speak to Major Kyle, and maybe I can find some way to help you all get out of this alive. Wait. Father Kyle will speak with you. Head to the building at the far end of the compound. Lugar de fanático, ó. Vamos ver se tem alguma coisa pra pegar por aqui. Isso aqui vai dar treta, mano. Já tô vendo. Other men from the Alliance. The Alliance sent assassins to kill Father Kyle, but we stopped them. Ele tá na parte de cima. Aqui não tem nada também. Ué, mano. Ele não tá aqui. Acho que ele tá lá naquela outra estrutura na, na rua. Ali, agora ficou verde, ó. If you try to take Father Kyle away from us, you'll end up like those other alliances. É, não tem nada para pegar aqui. Aqui tem, ó. Também tem. Ah, eu tenho que ver o seguinte aqui, ó. Eu tenho pontos para distribuir aqui, ó.
Gareth tem 12 pontos, ó. Vamos ver se pra cá tem alguma coisa também. É, acho que não. The Alliance wants to wipe us out. Father Kyle told us. Vamos ver se alguma coisa dessas me serve, né? Ó oh, o Edge 5 aqui. Pô. A pontaria cai muito. Não vale a pena. Ah, ah. Major Kyle, I know why you've come. We have no quarrel with you. Why can't you just leave us alone? You killed two Alliance officers. You had to know how this would end. They wanted to take me away from here. They wanted me to abandon this place, turn my back on my family. They spoke blasphemy. I did what I could to make their end quick and painless. I had no other choice. It was necessary to protect my children. Only I can keep them safe. The Alliance sent me to bring you in, Major. Can't you see this has gotten out of hand? Don't you understand you're endangering your followers? I respect that you have come under a banner of peace, but I cannot do as you ask. If you take away their father, my children will be helpless. You ordered your followers to kill those Alliance investigators. You must face the consequences of your actions. Do you really want your children to suffer for your sins too? No. This this was my fault. My children are innocent, pure. Please. I never meant for this to happen. I I'm Muito bom sorry. em investir em diálogo. Ó. You're doing the right thing, Major. Your children will be better off for it. Come on. Wait. If my children see you taking me away, they won't understand. They will attack and you will be forced to kill them all. You have shown me the error of my ways, Commander. Now you must give me time to explain it to them. It is the only way they will understand. Please, give me one hour. After that, I will meet the Alliance authorities at the gates of my compound and surrender without violence. I give you my word. I'm going to trust you. If you betray that trust, you and all your children will suffer. I will not betray you, Commander. Thank you for this. Your pilot can have an Alliance Command Patrol pick me. Aí, mano. Off. I just hope you know what you're doing, Shepard. Aí, deu tudo certo aqui, mano. Evitei até o um massacre aqui, né? Bom demais. É hora de cair fora. Vamos terminar de explorar esse planeta, ver se a gente acha mais recursos. Aí eu vou estar tá encerrando essa parte, galera. Por isso que é muito importante investir nisso aqui, ó. Encanto, ó. Só que eu não posso, não tem mais opção de investir ali, né? Ó, tinha uma caixa aqui que eu não vi, ó. Pô, deixa eu ver se isso aqui me serve. Ah, é a mesma pistola que eu, 
que eu tinha. Vamos ver o Garros aqui se tem alguma coisa melhor pra ele. Ó, essa sniper aqui é melhor pra ele, ó. Bem melhor. Ó, assim. Esse traje aqui, ó. Armadura média tour é bom pra ele, hein, ó. Melhora ele bastante. Quero ver se eu tenho alguma coisa pra minha armadura aqui que melhore, né? Tava usando isso aqui, ó. Vou botar isso aqui. Esse aqui perfura mais escudo, mas diminui o dano. Eu gosto do químico. O químico é bom, mas só tenho dois, né? Eu gosto disso aqui que investir em dano. Opa, esse aqui, ó. Aumenta o dano, mas a arma esquenta bem mais rápido. Vou deixar assim por enquanto nessa. Bom, ela tá investida em escopeta, né? Aqui, ó. O Firestorm é bom pra ela. Esqueci só de ver a armadura para ela. Essa aqui é melhorzinha um pouco. Ó. As duas são igual, ó, meio azulada. Achei bonita a armadura, hein? Não é feio, não. Onde é que é a saída disso? Acho que é pra cá. Fiquei já aqui. Vamos pra lá pra ver. Ponto de interrogação, a ah, anomalia ali, ó. Sonda colidida. Mapa da área. Não atualizou mais nada. Depois eu quero ver o que, que tem aqui, ó. É, 
verdade apareceu dois pontos de interrogação ali agora. Buraco, meu. Não vou subir aqui. Ah, ah, sem chance. Compros antigos, ó. Ao escavar sob o sinalizador, apareceu um item de metal, possivelmente de um cargueiro muito antigo. Em um lado, do... em um lado estava marcado com a insígnia do posto avançado de Macedim. Um veículo de mineração destruído. Descoberto. Mapa da área. É, não tem mais nada aqui. Vamos, vamos lá pra cima pra ver se eu acho mais um negócio de mineração. Nossa, cara, tá errado. Desvira. Queria usar o turbo, usei o negócio pra fazer subir o veículo, capotei o negócio. Esse planeta aqui é meio ruim de trafegar por ele. Muita cratera. Não cai nesse buraco. Aí. Opa, tem mais um ponto de interrogação aqui, ó. Já marquei ali. Eu quero ir aqui na frente pra ver o que eu acho. Ah, não vai subir, não. Vai ter campo aberto aqui, hein? Milagre que não tem inimigo aqui, hein? Vamos reto aqui. Nossa, eu vou ter que... Eu ia dar a volta por ali, mas não... Vou ver se eu, se eu consigo. Já tô aí por aqui, senão eu vou... Ó, já tava começando a destruir meu veículo, ó. Não é bom andar em zona vermelha. Ah, não vai subir aqui, meu? Sério? Fim negócio. Nossa, 
só cratera no negócio. Sobe. Deixa eu ver se eu consigo subir ali aí. Eu acho que eu subo. Aqui vai embalar, mano. Puta merda. Esse aqui já tá chato, mano. Eu não embala esse carro, velho. Tem que subir por lá. Vou chegar ali, mano. Porra. Isso. Aí, consegui. Puta merda, hein, meu aqui. Lugar que nem é broso esse aqui de subir. Conjunto de alojamento pré-fabricado tem a aparência claramente frágil. Há vestígio de exploradores que fugiram para as montanhas no sudeste. Aqui não tem nada. Parece que eu achei uma arma boa. Não, não achei. Aqui não tem nada. Bom, vou ver, ver o que, que tem aqui, ó. Se não tiver nada aqui, eu tô caindo fora. Aqui onde é que eu matei aquele verme. É, eu vou cair fora desse lugar aqui, mano. Não tem mais nada. E aqui parece que já era. Vou voltar até Normandia, hein?
que eu tenho que falar com o almirante. Eu não entendi agora se eu tenho que viajar para um outro lugar para falar com ele. Deixa eu ver aqui. Pô, acho que eu até já tava lá. Message coming in. Aqui, ó. Patching it through. Admiral Hackett here, Commander. Your helmsman just forwarded your report on Major Kyle. We sent in a team as you instructed. Kyle's followers have disbanded. And the Major surrendered to us without incident. We'll make sure he gets the help he needs. To be honest, Shepard, I thought this thing was going to end in a bloodbath. I don't know how you did it. But you saved a lot of lives. Congratulations. Bom, para finalizar essa parte aqui, galera, tem que ir até o sistema Strenos. Que é o nosso planeta, nosso sistema solar, né? nada aqui, cara. Deve ser aqui então, ó. Entendi direito, cara. Essa novela eu acho que é. Missão principal, deixa eu ver aqui. Não, acho que é aquilo ali mesmo. Eu já tava aqui, mano. Eu me lembro. Sobre o irmão do... Até esqueci o nome da mulher Aqui, ó Pistas do irmão de Garrett e sua nave Bom, galera, eu vou deixar isso aí pra próxima parte Agradeço a todos que acompanharam a gameplay Falou